One focus puller is given three minutes to answer as many questions as you can. This is the lunch break. This episode, we've got Andy Parziale, an amazing focus puller, a very, very experienced guy. I work with a lot, and uh, I think he actually worked on my very first commercial. Um, on this episode, great episode, we find out why his job is the only one where there's clear right and wrong. Let's find out. Hello, Andy Parziale. Hi, Phil. Welcome You're right. <laughs> Welcome, it's not that scary. No. Welcome to the lunch break, where you have three minutes to answer as many questions as you can. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah, that's you good. You ready? Right, let's go for it. Okay, I just need to... I always do this. I always mess around the timer. I'm efficient this time. Okay. They're hovering. Dan's going to be hovering. Want, they, they all, they all want to be part of the YouTube they all channel. Want in. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yep. Go! If you had to d describe your job in percentages, what would it be? Oh, crikey. <laughs> In percentages, you don't have to do a whole hundred percent, but just a, uh, okay. a flavour. It would be it would be uh, fifty percent helping the DOP or the operator. It would be uh, twenty percent being technical knowledge, mm -hmm. and it would be thirty percent just being aware on set and knowing what's going on that's, around you. That's good, and it also equals hundred percent. I, I know. <laughs> I was doing madly doing maths in my head then. What does your mum think you do? Uh, what does my mum think I do? Uh, mess around in TV, basically. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get to be a focus puller? Um, hard work and a bit of luck. Mm -hmm. uh, meeting the right people and just taking my opportunity when it was there. Okay. Um, one thing that annoys you about the industry? The hours, mm -hmm. some, a lot of the time. Um, because of the work-life balance? Yes, mm -hmm. very much so. Um, what would you have to do to make it? Like, I mean, oh. or you can say like, I've made, but is there something you could work on or like to say I've made it? Um, again, it's about taking and seizing opportunities uh, and being willing to sacrifice because mm -hmm. a lot of the guys that have quote unquote made it, mm -hmm. they've sacrificed a lot to get there. As a focus point, you'd be like doing a bond or something or doing... Yeah, oh yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Doing yeah. some, doing, uh, being a unit on a huge like yeah. feature film, that would be making it. What can directors do to make your job easier? Having a little bit of technical knowledge and understanding the difficulties you are going through. Often you find it really difficult to work the with a director who has absolutely no idea of what he's asking for. Mm -hmm. If he suddenly stuck you on a 100mm lens and wants a scene, a conversation scene of two characters running towards your camera and expects every single bit of it to be sharp, yeah, yeah you've <laughs> no. no chance. Uh, wide, <laughs> wide or long? Uh, long. Alexa or red? Alexa. Oh wait, what's going on with the timing? Oh no! Oh no, it's going, sorry. Um, film or digital? Uh, digital. Star Wars or Star Trek? Star Wars, definitely. Uh, uh, focus puller or first assistant camera? Focus puller. What's the worst thing about being a freelancer? Uncertainty. Mm -hmm. uh, Favourite film? You nail it uh, now. Um, uh, a New Hope. Um, best thing about being a freelancer? Uh, free time. <laughs> Sometimes. I'm going to run out of questions. Um, a piece of advice for like a budding focus puller? Uh, or someone to work up in yeah, the camera. Yeah, have awareness on set. Learn from your director of photography. Learn from your operator. Mm -hmm. you, you never stop learning. What do you love about your job? Uh, I, love the, I love the creative environment. Oh, oh. We'll never find out. <laughs> you can finish. I'll give you the I, answer. I love the creative environment that you're in. The fact yeah. that you're in this organic process. Mm -hmm. And yes, there are the, the leaders, the heads of department, they take you here and they, get, they sort of steer the course, but you're part of, part of like the making family. it involve, yeah. make it, you know, and you can offer things and you can help tell the story as a focus puller mm -hmm. because you, essentially you're setting a lot of what the audience is looking at. Mm -hmm. You're telling them where to look that is a true. lot of the time. That is true, <laughs> yeah. Um, and a lot of pressure, sorry. I need, yeah, I need yeah. time, guys, I need time. But yeah. I always think focus puller is a lot of pressure because it's one of those jobs where you, you only know you're there when you're doing it wrong, yeah. right? You're, you are the only person on set whose job is either right or wrong. Yeah, that's there, interesting. There's, there's, everybody else's job is subjective. Yeah. You're the only person <laughs> who Soft. it's right Soft. or it's wrong. Sharp. Yeah. Sharp. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's no middle ground. And uh, do you really enjoy it when directors shout out, it's soft! 
So, uh, yeah. to be so, totally, uh, it's soft. To be totally honest, it's helpful because yeah. a lot of the time you're but in a good nature. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, do, you don't like being barracked for uh, yeah. and, and constantly having it, but it's nice to know because you can then address the problem. Mm. If you don't know there's a problem, you can't address it. Yeah. And it's worse finding out the day afterwards when you can't do anything yeah. about it. Right. Um, That's yeah. it. Thank you, Andy. Pleasure. I've seen it. It's great. Now we, have to, now we have to pop out the frame. Oh. <laughs> oh, cool. How was that? That was good. Thank you. Hope you've enjoyed this episode of The Lunch Break. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel because there's going to be more episodes coming up every week. And if you have any questions or topics you'd like me to cover, leave them in the comments below and I'll feature them in upcoming videos.